So I'm starting off with my base already on. I can list the products below that I've used. Next, I'm going to go in with Milk Makeup's Matte Bronzer. This is a sample size. I do plan to get the bigger one as well, but this is what I have right now. I'm just going to bronze up my face a little bit. So I'm just going to put that down, take my Beauty Blender, and just rub that, pat that right in. I am also going to take that bronzer on the perimeters of my face, so my jawline and forehead. And I'm going to pat all that in with my Beauty Blender. So next I'm going to take this Maybelline Master Contour Strobing Stick. This is the iridescent, pink iridescent one, and I'm just going to put that on my finger and put that on the top of my cheekbones. I usually do this before my contour, but I totally forgot about it. You can see it just gives you a really pretty kind of glossy look. I'm also going to take that product and go down the nose. And I like to take it above my eyebrows, right like before the or on top of the arc of the eyebrow because it looks really pretty when you kind of turn your face and everything is uniform like that. I don't know if that's the right word. So I've already primed my eyes with Urban Decay Primer Potion. Now I'm going to take that same Milk Makeup Bronzer and I'm just going to take it on my finger and put it on my lids. I'm going to take a brush and blend that color in. Next, I'm going to take this Magnetic Eye Pencil by Nude Sticks. This is in the color Terra. And I'm going to go over that bronzer. So right where I've put the bronzer, I'm just kind of throwing this on top. I'm not being too neat with this because this is not really a neat look. I want it to look kind of messy and undone. And then with my fingers, I'm just going to blend that out. I'm also going to take Tara and go along the bottom lash line. I'm going to take a brush and blend that color in. Next, I'm going to take this Urban Decay Eyeliner. This is just the brown color. And I'm going to go and put that in my waterline. So next, I'm going to take another magnetic eye pencil. This is in the color Rustique. It's a really pretty rusty color. And I'm going to take that kind of upwards like this. So I'm starting like that, and I'm going to move it upwards. Kind of like how you would make a, v, um, a wing. And I'm kind of flipping it, not flipping it, taking it outwards like this. Then I'm going to take a brush and I'm going to blend out that line. I'm going to take Rustique and put that really close to my lash line. With the brush, I'm going to just softly blend that out. Okay, next I'm going to take this angled brush and a black liner and I'm going to put the liner on the brush. I do this when I want a bit of a thinner line because the pencil straight can be a little bit hard to work with. What I'm going to do with that is just stamp it like this really close to my lash line. So I also tight lined with that liner and put a little bit in my waterline as well just to make the look a little bit more smoky. If you don't want it to look smoky then stick with the brown liner. And now go ahead and add your favorite mascara. I am going to be using Tarte Lights Camera Lashes. I'm going to take that highlighter, that Maybelline one, and throw a little bit right under my brows. This is totally optional, but you can take some right here. You guys. Look what happened to my mascara. It just like broke. I don't know how. I think I was shutting it too tightly. And it just kind of... Uh, 
That's so sad. This is literally one of my favorite mascaras. Bye bye. Okay, for lips, I'm gonna go in with MAC Spice Liner first. Lightly line the lips. For lips, I'm gonna go in with this Tarte Lip Paint. It's the nude color. This is a sample. I don't know what color it is, but I will find it and list it down below for you guys. It's just a really pretty peachy nude. Okay, you guys, so here is the look. A really messy, grungy, copper, smoky eye. I don't know what the hell I'm gonna call it, but I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.